Okay, hello everybody. It's 2.48 p.m. and last hour trading. So, uh, what I'm looking at is 30-minute bars and we got higher highs and higher lows. So I think this is bullish. And uh, I'm going to uh, go to the long side here and try to get filled on a pullback. So I'm just going to let the auto trader trade and see if we can get a pullback here. Not sure we're going to get much of one, so I'm going in. I had to go to the market on that because uh, on the five minute chart, here's what I'm looking at. This is a uh, Superenco 8 tick chart, and it's trading uh, two contracts with a goal of 750. I'm approaching the high of the value area here, the developing value area, which is 87.70. I think it wants to test the high of the day. I'm going to trail a tight stop and I'm going to put a buy stop above here. Or if the auto trader pulls back and gives me red bars, I'll get taken in uh, that way. I'm actually going to do it this way. No, I'll let the auto trader take me long again. The reason I trailed the stop really tight was uh, it was approaching the high of the uh, developing value area. So we are almost halfway to our goal.
Okay, the auto trader took us back long. And uh, I basically gave up a couple of ticks to play it safe. Only 65.50 to 66.75, so not too bad here. Just trying to play it safe at the top here. Uh, here's the developing pattern on the five minute chart. I've got to get above uh, 87.70. I think the market's going to test the high of the day. I think that's what it's looking to do. Here's our 30 minute chart. Uh, so very bullish bar here. Okay, here we go. Uh, getting above the 70 level is key. Bring over the five minute chart. There we go. Okay, uh, almost there to our goal. Very close. There you go. Okay, a couple ticks of slippage. Uh, 725 on two contracts. And you see we got a split fill here. So, yeah, let me go over the reasons for that trade again. Uh, this big push up, and I, one of the rare times I just went to the market because uh, I wasn't sure this was going to give me enough of a pullback, and I went to the market here, and that uh, was the right move. And uh, I got out to kind of uh, protect what we had and in, in case this you know formed a lower high and then sold off and then might have went short if we had uh, a lower high and a lower low but uh, I let the auto trader take me long again and we got filled here and ultimately uh, hit our goal of uh, 750 on two contracts and look at that right close to the top okay that's it for today's trade
Uh, let me hear your comments on this. Okay, I just... Hello, I just wanted to come back uh, to the chart. Here's where we took the, the trade ended, was right here at uh, just before uh, 3 p.m. And then I said it would come up to the high end of the day, and indeed it did. Um, note the really nice pullback to the 60. Uh, on the five-minute chart, I had this line of support and resistance drawn here at uh, 88.03. And the reason it's drawn there, as you can see, market making new highs as we speak is uh, it was uh, 8800 is uh, support and then resistance and then support and then uh, breaking through here and then coming back down here uh, support breaking through and then coming back up uh, to it again this is where the five minute chart is right now almost to uh, this level up here, here's the high of the day, and uh, this pullback here was um, consistent with the market structure, uh, a low, a high, a higher low, and then a high and a, high, a higher high and a higher low, and this big push here. This could have been a change of direction as this uh, bar pushed down hard, but uh, it failed and looking at the 30 minute chart uh, helped me to see that all these bars are green here so these bars the 30 minute chart kept making higher highs and higher lows and both of these bars are very bullish so uh, excellent trade turned out really good and looks like this 83 to 8803 to 8810 is going to act as resistance this is the uh, high of the value area from um, yesterday actually and there's a high volume node here at 8826 so I imagine the market's gonna come up to this area and maybe stall and possibly go higher so uh, market's still making new highs now it's at 8803 that's all for this video thanks for watching